Hi, welcome to our video tutorial here. We're going to download our ISO and then burn it to a USB on Windows 10. We're at version 17.03 and we can download them here, the ISO versions, because there will be more versions in the future. And in fact, you have to decide which one. This is going to be launched the 1st of November 2017 and this one is going to be launched the 1st of October. So almost there, as you can see here, we're 2809. Making this tutorial, so you get inside here and you find an ISO. Of course, I have already uh, have this ISO already available. It's down here, as you can see, and we have um, opted to make a tutorial first about Rufus. And Rufus is explained down here. If you have a Windows system, we can recommend Rufus. I hope I pronounced it correctly. Anyway, it's a website. You follow the link, you download it, and as you can see, you saw already that I downloaded it and it's open. I changed it to English so everybody understands, but there are other languages available. And uh, what do you do? You say, okay, this is my USB. And then I set this one to MBR Partition Scheme BIOS or UFI, UEFI, I don't know pronunciation really. And this one is FAT32 and all of these things, I never changed it. So I'm gonna pop in my ISO because there is no ISO yet, it doesn't know what to do with it. So I said, this is the thing you need to burn. And now he pops in the name of this ISO. And all you have to do now, I guess, let's have a look again. So USB, partition scheme, cluster, all default, and the name, quick formats. All right, start. He's going to ask uh, maybe a question about files being downloaded. That was the first time, so this is the second recording because my Rufus was in Dutch and I thought, oh no, let's put it in English. So there's an, a pop-up in between telling you that we have to download two files, just say yes, okay, and now um, you have these files available and you can do the same as I can. You can burn it and he's going to make the ISO on the USB. Let's pause it here. Okay, let's unpause again. As you can see, it takes about four minutes to burn the ISO to the USB on uh, Windows 10 with Rufus. So there you go. We have now our USB, which is here, and we have everything available to start to try it out. All right, have fun.